Hello, sir, ma'am. My name is Gladys M. Porter, and you might think I'm dead, but somehow I'm back today to share my story with you and try to fit in along the way. <laughs> well, just wait while I explain it to you. I'm here today to share my story with you. I was born on August 4th, 1894, and was the child of Walter Richardson and Christina McPherson. My parents are pretty cool. <laughs> See, I'm fitting in with the slang of the age. Speaking of cool, my life only really gets cool once I joined the Nova Scotia House of Assembly. I am the first female member of the Nova Scotia House of Assembly. I was elected as mayor of Kentville in 1946, making me the first female mayor in the Maritimes, PEI, Nova Scotia, and New Brunswick. That's a pretty amazing thing. My husband, Wyman H. Porter, and I had two beautiful daughters. Their names... I'd rather not disclose. Three years before I was elected as mayor, when I ran for mayor, I became part of the Kentville Town Council. What's the word I heard someone use? Oh, yes. As the youngsters say, I'm pretty slay. <laughs> not sure if that means to kill someone, but it's fine, I guess. <laughs> I had shockingly beat my male opponent by a two-in-one margin to become mayor of Kentville in 1946. Woohoo! Go me! I was re-elected, then served 11 years until 1960 when I went and became an MLA. That's a member of the Legislative Assembly, which is a representative elected by the voters of a group of people in a specific area. Most often, the term refers to a subnational assembly, such as that of a state, province, or territory of a country. I was so proud of myself. I've accomplished so much in my life. This is truly a new beginning to women in power, in the Maritimes, of course. <laughs> oh, yeah, I have a bridge named after me. I completely forgot to tell you about that. Well, I was the MLA responsible for securing provincial funding for the bridge when it was originally being built. When I had gotten enough funds for the project, as any lovely human would do, <laughs> they named the bridge after me. I thought that was just so kind. This bridge is located in what used to be Port Williams. I think it's still named that in your time today. I'm not too sure. Maybe I'll go check sometime. Well, sir, ma'am, that's really all from me. I hope you thought my life was somewhat interesting and maybe I'll see you again when you pass on to the next life with me. I hope I used your slang words right and I'll be on my way back where I came from. Actually, maybe I'll stop by and see my great, great grandchildren. If they're still living there, that is. We'll see. Anyway, bye-bye, loves. Have a wonderful day full of excitement and joy. Don't waste your life away.